What is going on and welcome back to a Modern Warfare 3 video. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a guide on how to unlock gold camo fast and easy in Modern Warfare 3. Throughout my time playing so far, my experience in getting my first gold gun, I've got a few different things here to be able to share with you that should make your experience in getting your gold gun a lot faster than it would otherwise. So if you enjoy, be sure to give it a like for the algorithm and subscribe with all notifications turned on and let's hop into this. So let's hop in here and let me show you guys my first ever gold gun. So I'm currently level 22 as of right now and the first gun I have gold is going to be the striker here aka the ump submachine gun we're gonna go over here to the customization you can see i do happen to have gold camo as i've been kind of focusing a little bit on this one here and let's go over some of the challenges real fast i'll show you guys kind of that they're not really too difficult so first thing here is going to be this amigra uh camo here so it's basically just 50 kills of the striker which is realistically incredibly easy to be able to do and then second is going to be the 25 hip fire kills which sometimes can be a little bit harder a little bit tricky depending on how sweaty people are that you're going up against uh, third one here is going to be the 10 kills while crouching, which is not too difficult. And lastly, if you get 15 kills on operators while they are affected by your tactical, aka like with a stun grenade, a flash grenade, that was the most pain in the ass one to be able to do. Otherwise, getting gold camo here by like pretty much getting 10 kills without an enemy damaging you, that's probably the easiest challenge to get gold I think I've ever done genuinely. And of course, after gilded camo, once you get that, or gold as I like to call it, there's forged camo here, which is going to be like your platinum equivalent. We have priceless which will be your poly atomic equivalent and then we have interstellar which in my opinion is like you know orion camo but like 10 times better such ember games knows how to make camos actually nice and a game that's actually fun so one of the most overlooked things here when it comes down to getting gold camo easily is going to be your playlist and what you happen to play so your playlist filter here is going to be your best friend when it comes down to actually being able to get your challenges and stuff complete for me personally right now i have this set on hardpoint because i was trying to get an actual gameplay to showcase which i'll show you guys here in a little bit some actual gold camo gameplay uh, but if you're actually going to be leveling guns up here to get your challenges done something like kill confirmed and maybe even search and destroy can be good but search is a little bit one of those things that while you get more xp per kill you are going to be a, a bit of a disadvantage if you're not going to be getting those kills because obviously it's not like respawn game mode whereas kill confirm all that xp that you get from taking somebody out and also picking up the tag will count to leveling up your gun and it also there is a benefit where kill confirm makes you want to move around and that is super super beneficial when you're trying to get those challenges especially like when you're trying to like stun people because you need people to be moving around though i did find personally that when i was playing hard point that kind of worked a little bit better for stunning people just because everyone was trying to congregate onto the hard point so maybe for that specific challenge hard point will work better when you're trying to stun people or get people that are affected by your tactical but otherwise all these other modes pretty much like kill confirm and domination should be pretty good probably just stay away from search and destroy if you're not that strong of a player or if you don't really want to play it that much another thing to take into consideration is that all of your weapon xp tokens do transfer over from modern warfare 2 so if you're going to be actually playing the game and trying to level your gun up to maximum level which does of course unlock those other challenges because they are challenge or level locked you should actually be using your double weapon xp you can activate up to you know of course an hour or more but i definitely recommend for you guys to be able to do that especially when you're trying to grind out these levels it makes all the difference in the world World when it comes down to ranking up your gun faster plus getting those challenges done quicker and a little bit of an extra thing right here is that i know this is locked for me currently so i can't exactly vouch for it but people are really enjoying war mode for leveling up their guns and getting those challenges complete so definitely try that out especially if you're not going to be just going into like you know the quick match or something else like that i feel like that's a very beneficial way to be able to level up your guns we get a lot of good feedback from my friends that are doing it themselves but apart from those things that i've labeled out there's not exactly going to be a ton of little hidden bits tips and tricks to be able to get your gold camo incredibly fast because it's not like it's a model for 2019 grind where that was just kind of abysmal and i personally didn't grind it out that much this is very doable and you can get a gun done probably in underneath about an hour of in-game time which is pretty good depending on how sweaty the lobbies are that you're going to be in uh this is pre-release so i've been dealing with a little bit of extra sweatage because the only people that are on are the most engaged call of duty players possible so that is what it is but anyways i have some gold camo gameplay here to showcase you guys and i dropped my best gameplay yet here since i've been on the model warfare 3 servers i hope you guys enjoy that one enjoy some gold camo gameplay all right let's actually let's use this gold camo here very gil gilded camo more or less wanted to actually get a nice little live gameplay here with it so I, I haven't had a chance to oh my god you know there, there's everyone right there i didn't have a chance to even use this yet i was so focused on unlocking it that i pretty much
Yo, I was about to say, can I get my shots? I'll tell you what though, sometimes you do be for real dying fast, even though there is that health increase. You do be biting the dust. I got you teammate, don't worry about it. I'm telling you, this gilded, it's its gold, but you know, it's called gilded camo in this game. And I'm telling you, it looks absolutely beautiful. Yo. Oh my lord. Hey, thank God for that 60 round mag. I mean, it's me to get a UAV going or something, man. All right, well, I'll do it. I'll do it for us. I actually really enjoy having a suppressor on our gun and thank the Lord that Sledgehammer actually gave us a suppressor we can use that doesn't have a ton of cons and it, it actually has no cons when you do use it, but I actually don't have that specific one on. So I want one that gave me a little bit more damage range. My oh, man's was jumping around over there. Better get up top. A little dirty spot right there. I need that perk where I can actually uh, pretty much that's like dead silence. Because I'll tell you what, that does make a difference. There we go. I'm trying not to be as aggressive with it because, hey, people... People, people be sweating it out pre-release. This is technically only about like a little close to like noon and man, the U S copies aren't even really technically supposed to be able to get on. He was able to get on via like a, a session join if you had someone else on. So to able to get on via PC. Yeah, this thing is still disgusting at range. that one yeah I'll say that almost using this is like a like an AR whoa I did not want to do that oh Mike Mike my air strike is glitching out over there that support helo yes sir oh and i got stunned and like man this and this challenge is everything like i was telling you guys earlier in the video for it but Getting stunned sucks. I'm, I feel like I'm getting stunned a lot here, trying to get some challenges or trying to get just get gameplays. Now you all see me here. You at least use the gold camo for a little bit, like, but the gilded camo. What do you what do you think of it? W or an L? Personally, personally, I'm gonna say this camo is actually pretty gas. I think from what I've seen from even the other camos too that I have not unlocked yet, they look so so much more, more vibrant and interesting. And the MW2 camos. Like even just off rip, because a lot of the MW2 camos had to be like I feel like updated in order to even look good. Like especially Orion camo, that thing like didn't move at all, didn't do nothing, and Sledgehammer seems to not be Infinity Ward, and they you know they listen. It's really nice. Ooh, did I just get that? But we can pick these guys off. Oh, actually, we'll be able to do that with this. Oh, 
Check I'm only ranked 21 here and I got my first gold gun here like way before that, which is actually super solid. Requesting close air. I feel like I'm playing a little bit campy at the moment, but I want to stay alive as much or as long as possible. All right, let's push up. Yo, they still spawn. They spawning back here. Damn! What are we on a ruthless right now? A Fifteen. Oh, I spoke too soon. For real spoke too soon. I think it was like sixteen or whatever it was. Ah, so there was someone over there. Oh, damn! Wait. How many? They're spawning right here. Oh my god! Damn! We're just throwing that down there. This has definitely been one of my better games. I'm not gonna cap. One thing I will say right now is that for any guys that are playing this, you'll notice that the radar, it doesn't actually show what level someone's on. So I'm so used to war zone where it does, which I don't know why they removed that, but I wouldn't mind if they put that back in the game. I'd like to see what level people are on and building wise. Nice. We're at 16 right now. Wait, they're they're re they're actually all right down there. Oh, I gotta get out. I no oh, man, I couldn't get away from that. Damn. Damn, dude. We should have won that. How many kills? I had 86 kills. That's my most kills I've ever gotten on this game so far. So. I'll take that. Hope you guys enjoyed the Gold Gun gameplay. If you did, be sure to give it a like, subscribe, notifications turned on, and I'll see you guys next time.